everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to freak someone out with this DIY toothpick in hand tutorial. This is so easy and it will definitely scare someone, so let's go ahead and get started. So what you're going to need is some red polish, a top coat, and black polish. A nail file, a toothpick, and some scissors. First, take the toothpick and cut it. Now the shorter you make it, the deeper it will look as if it went into your hand. So I like to cut it about halfway, but this is totally up to you. Now to make sure that you don't hurt yourself, you're going to file it down with the nail file. And this is just going to prevent it from hurting your hand. And I'm just going to do this until it is very smooth. Now taking the red nail polish, you're going to paint it onto a tiny piece of your hand and I just made it really weird and that's pretty much it. This is up to you on how big you want it. And now I'm putting the black nail polish onto a paper and you can also use acrylic paint if you don't want to use nail polish but this is all that I had so I'm just going to be using this. Now I'm taking the foundation sponge and I'm dipping it into the black nail polish and making sort of like a weird circle around the red. This just kind of make it makes it look like rotten almost. You can use green if you want to. Um, that's optional of course, but I just kind of kept layering this until I liked it. So I'm just going to keep sponging it on and that's pretty much it. So now you're going to attach the toothpick with the clear polish and for this I really really recommend a dry fast top coat because if you don't it's going to take forever for this to stick and I accidentally put too much of the top coat on and it didn't dry fast enough so for this if you're going to do this make sure that you apply a thin layer and if it doesn't stick apply another thin layer and you hold it there very long so that way it doesn't come off if you're wearing this for Halloween. So as you can see, I didn't hold it long enough and this is what happened. But anyways, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I will see you next time. Bye!